it's happy mail queen welcome back to my channel today I wanted to share a very quick project that I created for scrap diva designs here is Erica's information scrap diva designs.com and you can find all the dies that I used here if you're interested um, just go ahead and go to my description box and I will have the links for you for each of the dies and I believe they are all in stock right now, but I'm, ma I'm basically mainly featuring the Dragonfly Shaker. Um, had to put this one together. It's so cute and I thought it went appropriately with the paper collection that I'm using and the summer theme that I'm going with. So um, I did create with this and then let me just share with you the essential bundle number one love this die set um, again I can't stop raving about it because I'm constantly using it um, all the time so um, as you guys know it comes with the uh, two different uh, circle sets as well as the two oval sets one is just a regular stitched and the other one is um, this pattern right here which I love and um, for my project though I just used the round one and I used the two largest one I believe and then I decided to revisit this um, die set right here which is the summer word so it's perfect for your summer projects and um, these are some of the words in case you don't remember relax sun vacation vibes beach please and also summer and fun which I used on my project and then had to revisit this one as well as the bathing suit mini album die because these kind of go hand in hand and and also with the summer words so um, had to use it so let me go ahead and share what I created for you guys I wanted to use this um, older collection from Frank Garcia uh, by Prima and it's called Santorini and I absolutely love this paper for the dragonfly shaker I created this using um, the floral pattern paper from um, Santorini uh, collection it's so so pretty it's one of my favorite um, papers and um, there's the summer fun um, that I had shared with you guys before but you know I finally used it on my project I was determined to use this um, these words um, on my project they are popped up um, on foam and um, of course this one is popped up because it's a shaker and I did put some shaker bits in there and um, I've seen a few of you guys um, use some flowers to decorate your uh, dragonfly so I went ahead and did that and I think it came out really cute and I did um, I wasn't sure if I was gonna make it a card because I have seen some really fun circle cards uh, but I decided you know what I want to put it on a stick <laughs> um, and it just reminds me of a fan you know for the summer so I did put it on a uh, this is not a craft stick what is this called uh, a dowel and then I had these pretty ribbon that went perfectly um, you know it was in my stash so it went perfectly with the colors of this paper and I thought this blue um, um, this is uh, from Cricut and it's the holographic paper I thought it went well with this um, and I just think it's really really pretty so I love how that came out I also used some of the bling here um, that is from the Santorini collection um, however just to let you guys know Erica is now selling um, say it in crystals and uh, you guys have to check it out so she has all kinds of different colors so I might have to tell her to send me some of those <laughs> when I'm uh, back from um, you know my little vacation that I'm gonna be taking so um, I'm not really going anywhere I'm just working on stuff so uh, and then here is like I said I revisited this die and I absolutely had to make another one of these because I think this has to has to be one of my favorite summer dies of hers right now because I absolutely just love making um, this little cute bathing suit mini album and since um, this was perfect with the Santorini collection 
I thought I'd go ahead and create it. And so as you can see, all the um, the uh, embellishments are from the collection. Um, here's that bathing suit, though, that is part of this die set. The little bathing suit. So cute. And then here's the surfboard. Again, I love using the surfboard with this die. So you can kind of barely see it peeking because then I did um, some um, layering. But it's so cute. And I just made a little charm right there. And um, just used this flat back from my stash. And this says lost in paradise so i just made some mats i didn't de decorate it very much because i'm actually putting this um inside a little bucket um which is part of her die set as well but i'll share that with you guys later on it's the sand bucket i believe which is out of stock right now but anyway we'll get back to that later um so so i made some mats and I can definitely tuck in a picture because this is more of a um, like a belly band. So um, I can still put a picture in there. But this would be my mat. But isn't that pretty? That is Santorini, you guys, which is in Greece, which is one of my hopefully future destinations. <laughs> I really want to go there and... Um, the reason I pulled out this collection is because my aunt recently was telling me how she's planning a trip um, next year. So, and I had tried to plan a trip to Santorini a few years ago and it didn't quite um, happen, but that's still on my bucket list. Okay, these are tickets right here. Oh, one ticket and then this is just one of the ephemeras and again, um, I love making just these little uh, pockets where I can stick a um, picture and a mat and a mat here. Isn't this collection pretty? I just love the papers. There's lots of florals and um, and I love these little tickets that says Santorini. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's so perfect if I ever go there and um, if I ever get to... You know travel and take pics I'm definitely gonna put pictures in this album um, that's chill in there and then again just more tickets and um, and in the back I didn't do anything so it's a total of six pages um, again I didn't want to make it bulky like the last one I did do you guys remember the last bathing suit let me go ahead and get it just to show you so here was the last bathing suit um, mini that I created and as you can see you can make it with any paper I mean this is like super colorful I think a lot of you guys liked the, the nice bright colors um, this one's a little more subdued but equally as pretty I think but yeah just to give you guys some ideas more ideas and this is a must-have, you guys. I, I've been even telling my friend uh, Sophia, who is Paper Sweets, who is um, actually uh, guest designing for this month, I believe, for uh, Erica for Scrap Diva Designs. I told her, you have to get this die because it's just too cute and it's so easy to put together. So anyway, that is my project share for today. Thank you so much for stopping by and yes if you are interested um, don't forget to use my coupon code and that is happy mail q10 and thanks for watching